uh, do you still want me to leave? I can handle this. Bella is um, a very feisty woman. She is the owner of the Empire Drinking Hall, uh, which is somewhat of a facade for the criminal underworld that she runs. You come here as a wealthy toff willing to spend money, fine. <laughs> you come here as a lawyer, you're about as welcome as a fart in a perfume factory. People may find at first that Bella is rather brash and rather forceful and um, quite intimidating. You come on my turf, there are consequences. Well, this, this is my turf beef. Get out now and don't come back. But as the story goes on, I hope that she becomes more relatable because she very quickly falls in love with Hyde because he makes such a huge impression on her in such a short time. Can't you ever use the door like a normal person? They are kind of like kindred spirits in a strange way. And for me, that was the hook for the whole character. Beware the one-eyed man. You what? What's going on down there? Why are they following Garson? Good question. Hyde is a very bold, quite destructive personality. He absolutely brings chaos into Bella's world. She has a very set routine. Her life is sorted. She's worked her way up the criminal empire and she now runs it. And he turns everything upside down. He changes her world and everything that she once knew, she now doubts. So. How about you let me take care of this spring chicken jack for you? That time did something useful. This is my promise. Mm -hmm.